Hey guys, guess what? We have got more Proline tires up for grabs. So write me a comment why you need these tires. You've got new rigs, you're building old rigs, you're changing old rigs, your tires are tired, or you just need to upgrade your tires. Write me a comment, guys. The guys who write me a comment, I will put you guys in the final draw and let's see who wins the final prize. Now let's get back into today's video. Hey guys, last week we put some clear windows onto the TRX4 Sport Body. And today, we are going to do the same with the Axial. So, I've always wanted a black Jeep. But people tell me, black doesn't look good on the camera, you can't see the contours of the car very well. So, I've got an idea to give it not a shiny finish, but a sheen finish. Not matte, somewhere in between. So, let's get going. I'm going to take all the armor off. The roof rack off the lights off and let's prepare the car for paint So we have the roof racks off, we have the electronics, the lighting off. And now we're just going to give this dusty car a bit of a clean. And then we're going to cut out the front windscreen and the rear windows. The side windows I actually want to have tinted, but I'm going to cut them in such a way that it looks like they are open. So I'm going to cut them up here and this way, but I'm going to keep them tinted. So the only two windows that are going to be clear is the front and the rear ones and the side windows will be halfway wound down. So let's cut out the windscreen and the back window. Like last week, I'm going to be using the back edge of my cutting blade and just scorch around the area that I want to cut and then I'm going to push out the window. I'm just going to go around it another two, three times.
And finally, everything has been cut out. The windows are open. Back window is out because we do have the armor plating that goes over it. Rear window is out and windscreen is out. I'm going to leave all the hinges and the door handles on. Now we are getting this car ready for spray painting. These are not stickers. They are actually lasered into the body so we can't take those off. So I'm just going to give it a clean and then get it ready for paint. So while this is drying, I'm going to quickly move over here. So we've got some space here on the ping pong table and we can start with hot glue gunning the windows into the body. So I've cut out the windows just a little bit bigger using the original as a template. Same with the front windscreen and now let's just put these aside we're going to begin with the front windscreen and first we're going to take the protective foil off this thing is to turn the car around and place the window inside what i'm going to do is first i'm going to glue the center let that cool down and then work myself to the outside Okay, all the parts are outside, in the sun, drying. Just 
just going to change the tabletops quickly then i'm going to get all the drive parts back inside and assemble the body okay first things first let's take off the window stickers okay i'm gonna start off with the rear windows putting the body armor on the scoop the angry eyes the snorkel rear view mirrors everything all right let's begin all right i am finally done let me just connect the lights put the body on let me see how it fits over here yes clipping it in okay just gonna let it stand like this for now oh hang on a secky we need to put it onto the lazy susan so some parts are a little bit dirty <laughs> But in total, it is everything I ever wanted. <laughs> it absolutely looks sick. I just don't know if I like these tinted windows. Seeing that these are clear windows now and those are tinted, I thought it looked good, but I'm kind of not liking that look. But maybe we sort that one out in next week's video. What do you think, guys? 
So that's it for me this week. Don't forget, guys, we have got the tire giveaway coming up end of next month, not this month. And subscribe to the channel. Write me a comment why you need your tires or those tires. It's a Proline Corolla tires, guys. Write me a comment why you need the tires, what you need it for, what rig you're building, and I will put you in the final draw. Okay, guys, that's it for me this week. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you guys next week. Bye. Move on, move on. Lights! <laughs>